Wakurugenzi sijui mwaka ni gani, sijui tarehe ni gani, sijui mwezi ni gani. Kile najua bana kuna dereva anasukuma lori zile za CIT cash in transit ni zile lori ambazo zinabeba pesa zikichukua kutoka kwa banka ama zikipeleka kwa banka so amepita kwa street flani sikoshua kama ni ele ama ni wapi ameshashika street flani sasa yeye anajua in the next like 600 meters ndakuwa nimefika pale kwa junction ya kuingia kwa bank all of a sudden kwa side mirror anaona pikipiki ya cop inapiga ma siren deadly deadly wana anajaribu kum flag down maze so of course hii ni very sensitive unajua ambeba pesa hapa kuna karao hapa nyuma maze ana ana flag down maze so akapiga ma brake hapo teketeke so karao akapita na bike fuu akakama kaya paka hapo mbele akashuka very fast akakuja akabang mlango nani shuka 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 So bana anashindwa ni nini? Anaambiwa lori bana imewekwa explosive iko na bomb. Shuka maze fast inahesabu. Eh hey, jamaa akafungua mlango teketeke. Akaambiwa toka mbio, toka mbio, clear clear kopa naambia wasema maze tokeni, tokeni bana kuna aso me rig explosives kwa ikash in transit. Endeni maze as far as you can. Kimbieni mwisho kabisa enda. Majamaa waka. Hey, wewe. Hiki tu. Dereva wewe hiki tu wewe take a baby Skari akaweka mpikipiki kando kakuja akaingia kwa cash in transit akaipiga kifunguo wanamtafuta mpaka leo <laughs> Katfule washa hiyo taba na species stronger cars Mkurugenzi's outfit is available on www.mkurugenzi.co.ke. Ingia pale upate luku yako baridi. Wa kurugenzi! <laughs> Mama wadao wadao. First of all, hata kabla niseme kitu, luku imetia ijati. Yes. Yeah, luku imeenda shule mbaya sana, imepiga graduation. <laughs> ah, hii mtu yangu hii. Ah, hii ni matata. Matata very interesting thing about this particular design Kuna mtu alipiga hii picha I think some three years ago na kasahau tu So majama wangu pale wa design design bana waka wakakutana naye waka ensure eh hey, buda ile design ulikuwa unataka kutengeneza logo yako na picha Since wewe ni mtu umejia line stories za Nairobi sana situeke hii picha umse tick weka Kumbe picha za watu wazitumi wangu hivi hivi. <laughs> we? Bahati, bahati. Kitu ikaniambia, lakini ya beli. Unajua unakimbia tuna hizi picha. Si unge tu na se tafuta huu mwenye uwezi mkosa. Muulize tu form ni gani? Nikamvutia. Akaniambia mazee, juu ya kunipigia na kukosa kwenda chini ya maji hatutakosana. Tutafanya bill fit, juu yenyewe hata mimi nimeona hiyo design ina T iko sawa. So kuna vile tumesikizana. So mazem ki support t-shirt mna support mkurugenzi kikosi yake na mpiga picha fulani ambaye hako hata nakumbuka hii picha in exist. So asanteni sana. Hii itaenda kazi. Hata ile ingine ya Nairobi by ini Nairobi by day, eh? by night. So kuna Nairobi by day yenye nilikuwa nayo ile episode ingine. Yeah, a very talented photographer anaitwa Mutua Mazeka, the truth slinger. Hatari sana. Mnamtambua? Eh? Fire, fire. Anyway, um leo tuko na announcements kweli isipokuwa tu ile yetu ya kawaida ya sinema hiyo hiyo itakuwa kila episode hiyo mtachoka hiyo ah haki tukikosa kugonga 50,000 itaniuma haki sitaingia hiyo 35 vizuri lakini nawatambua nyinyi ni wa true Mta... au nimeinua the wrong leg <laughs> mumesikia imekata <laughs> ah tumerudi sisi tumerudi sio tuko swafi eh wacha nikimbize hii story jo kabla ikate tena <laughs> ah wakurugenzi kuna mambo imefanya robi 
Hii Nairobi kuna watu wamekutanishwa. Hey. Nikasema hii wacha tu nipigie wakurugenzi story. In fact, hizi story sababu si moja, ni mbili. Nitapiga cocktail ya story mbili tutazicombine into one episode. Sababu I mna need kujua. Wa 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 Vitu watu wamefanywa hii town. Story number one. Wadau ilikuwa mnamo 2012. <laughs> kuna area inaitwa utawala na grow sana ma buildings zina huko zimechipuka deadly lakini hakuna mtu alijua hii story iko based utawala until very recently like juzi sana na ni bahati tu watu walijua hii story kumbe ili happen utawala Let me tell you what happened. In fact, hii kitu ilikuwa world class. Hata sijui mbona hakuna news nini uh, station ilichukua hii story. Like haiku reportiwa anywhere. It's, it's unbelievable. Majamaa wametoka town. Wanaenda wapi? Wanaenda I think ilikuwa either umoja ama those sides Juma tatu ilikuwa inapitia outer ring road. So majamaa wametulia pale town wanangoja ngoja nini? Eh unajua vile matatu bana mnashangaa eh matatu ya leo haikawi haijai form is vipi So amekaka amekaka imebaki kama takriban uh, mtu saba wakaona tu squad ya mtu saba imeingia pamoja Hup! ndani ya mathri Wasa wakaingia wakaketi wakaketi vipoa nini nini ah matatu ika kaskumu wateketeke ah kidogo kidogo wameenda wamefika mahali fulani Jamaa moja kwa wao wa saba akashuka akaenda pale mbele akafungua mlango ya so huku mbele kwa driver si kuna mlango ya passenger hapa kaenda akafungua hiyo mlango pop kaambia jamaa ameketi hapo oya ni aje kibronches shuka ingia hapa nyuma tafadhali kuna kitu nataka kuchapiana na driver na ni very urgent so jamaa anashindwa okay first of all this is very weird mimi nimekaa hapa wewe unatoka huko nyuma unakuja hapa kuniambia nitoke uongee na driver kwani mimi sina story na driver lakini sababu wa Kenya tumejifundisha hakuna kuuliza maswali. Ah. Haidhuru. Akashuka, akaenda akapanda matatu nyu, nyuma. Malaika angemtembelea, kitu ingemwambia, usipande hiyo matatu tena. Akaenda akaingia na akachukua position pale nyuma ya conductor. Wakaenda mpaka wakisengenya huyu mtu hapa mbele. Na ni ghasia ya wapi? na kuja kunitoa kwa kiti na vile kula marege huko mbele ni sawa tu so ameenda enda ameenda enda ah hiyo matatu i think ilikuwa inapita kuna matatu za green zinaendaga dandora somewhere za kwaka green green kuna mtu amecheka hapo ndi kama ame experience na zinaendaga na outer ring road eh ni forward oh forward si za yole kuna kayole na d bas so destination in a dictate hakuna wakati itafika tuingie kangundo road tunaenda dandora so si tutafaa tupite kangundo road tuiwache tui tuende straight mpaka pale mbele after buruburu k south hapo mbele kuna za kwenda dandora za moyo airbase ni moyo airbase mambo yeah lakini kidogo kidogo wamefika pale ikakula hii kitu inaingia wapi All of a sudden umati ya mtu saba ika, sita ikasimama tu wap ndani ya matatu haya kila mtu chini buda ushawahi toshea katikati ya kiti <laughs> mti yangu walitoshea hapa between kiti na huyu na hii hapa mbele hapa kaeni hapo na muenjoy road trip sababu tutazunguka zunguka So matatu ikaanza kukula lap. Nikiwaambia ninajua mahali hii matatu ilikuwa inaenda, takuwa na wadanganya. Sababu hakuna mtu aliona isipokuwa dereva na huo msee amekaa pale mbele. Ikazungushwa, 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 ikazungushwa kidogo kidogo ikasimama mahali. Ikatulia kama dakika tatu, nne, tano. E, ikaanza tena safari. Ikakaa mtena ikakuja, 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 ikakuja. Wale watu wakiiteka ilikuwa kitu kama saa kumi jioni karasha wakajaanza 
Sasa tumeenda tumepiga malap huko. Sasa tuko huko masaa 12. But inapiga tu maraundi. Tuko malap. Kumbe watu wanangojea jua iset. Wanangoja giza. Ikaingizwa vichaka sijui wapi. Wasea waongelee shui wanashindwa form ni gani. Kitu ikaenda ikatulia place fulani wasawa kaambiwa wapumue kidogo lakini upumue ukua hapo chini tafadhali usi. So majamaa wakaka wakaka it was a long wait. Hakuna mse anajua hapa tunaelekea wapi next. Nobody knows. So wameketi kidogo wakaanza kusikia masauti chir chir yes in cricket. Hapo kagiza kameanza kuingia. Wakaambiwa haya sasa mtaka standby. Eh tulieni tu vile mko e, tunapiga tu one one last trip alafu after hapo kila mtu atakuwa sa atakuwa sawa mumekula lunch leo kuna mtu hajapata kitu ya kuuma hata kidogo mko sawa mumekula saa sawa mko fit very nice matatu ikapigwa kifunguo tena ndio inatoka ikaenda ikazunguka zunguka inazunguka tu Nairobi wanasikia tu makelele huko nje nini but madirisha zimefungwa wanasikia tu ya tuko kwa barabara all of a sudden kuna kelele all of a sudden hakuna all of a sudden kuna simama simama ni kama kuna traffic mahali all of a sudden hakuna so hizi malap zote zilikuwa za kuwa disorient sasa imefika point hata wameacha ku guess wameacha hata ah we mahali mtatuweka mtu we mtuweke walizungushwa hivyo wadau takriban 4 5 hours wanapiga tu lap na matatu ni kama wako road trip ikafika mida ya saa tatu usiku saa tatu usiku ndio matatu ilikuja to a stop to a halt wakaambiwa nao mnaweza kusimama wanasimama wanapata wako mahali ni giza tupu apart from kataa kamewashwa mahali kwa site Said ni ya nini mjengo you are right wakashukishwa kwa matatu wote vizuri one by one one by one one by one wanaulizwa hapa panaka familia unajua ah oh, jiba liko very nice very nice taka tuingie pale kwa store kila mtu ajiami na zile mifuko za simiti na tusisumbuane ni nani hapa anajua kuoperate machinery? Jama moja akainua mkono akasema in fact niko nyumbani. Vile mnaniona hivi nimetoka kazi hapa hill niko nyumbani mnatakaje? Hiyo mashini ya koroga utakaa na ule jamaa utamsaidiana hapo. Sasawa. Akina mama muko wapi? Hii mbogi ikisikia ubao na tumeweka uji kwa store mutaona fire kila mtu ashikilie pakiti yake ya famila uende wewe nyinyi ukoteni kuni nyinyi sufuria ndiyo hizo ni nani ako na talanta ya kukanda chapati sitaki kusikia sitaki kusikia ni umati yangu ya watu 31 33 wako na njaa na mko hapa tutakosana mbaya sana Wangapi wajapata duty za jikoni please please Very good Nyinyi ndio mtasaidia kuchota maji 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 Haya wanaume mnangoja niwaambie Hizi mawe za jichonga Ha Mawe zile zishachongwa zitajileta kwa site Mna mchezo Mna mchezo Wangapi wanasema hamna Sunday best nini haya mtoe viatu muweke kando Hizo karatasi za simiti mumetumia mchukue mutengeneze ribok. Sikuja hapa bana uko na simiti ndani umesweat huko imeshikana kiatu imeganda na simiti uanze kutulaumu no 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 no. Hivi sasa ni mida ya saa tatu usiku. Ladies tumewapatia mpaka 10:30. Uji na chapati zitembee hapa An- bottomless. Bottomless. Yaani ni bottomless. Usidanganywe na mtu kuna mtu atakuuliza unga a a a a Unga tuko nayo, uji ndiyo hiyo, nyinyi chezeni kinyinyi. Bas. Ule mdeadly kupika ni nani? Wewe ndiyo mdeadly. Wewe sasa utatutengenezea mchele na stew kando ndiyo tu. 
tuwachunge na ikatuwezi wachunga na tuko na uji na chapati tutalala alafu muhepe hapana no 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 wacha watu waanze hii kitu hiyo <laughs> time hakuna ati zile cranes za kupandisha ati simiti kutoka hapa mpaka hiyo gorofa ya pili hapana wamejipanga wanaume wawili hapa wanaume wawili hapa wanaume wawili e, simiti wewe wadao break ilikuwa mida ya saa saba usiku wakajimundi ya machapati prop saa saba na dakika 30 sharp walipiga hiyo wera wadau mpaka mida ya saa 12 sharp kabla tujua iwake vizuri wakafungwa tena kwa macho wakarudishwa ile position mtu yangu hakuna kitu mbaya kama kupigwa kazi ya mjengo alafu wakati wa kupumzika wewe kwa nini umjaji uliza kwa nini lori za construction watu wenda kama wamesimao umeshinda pa position fani the whole day lazima tu uende mtaka umesimama joju ili kwa ni matata matata deadly so wakapigishwa kazi ya mjengo wakafika asubuhi wakaachiliwa wakapigishwa malaplap flani flani ikaenda ikaachiliwa tena Kangundo Road huko huko na hiyo Kangundo Road wanaipenda kuna mali huko kunaitwa malaa kuna kitu na KBC huko unaona tu mawaya machuma za KBC kwa milima huko nothing wakaacha huko na matatu yao na majamaa waka, wakazidi that was i think huko 2012 2011 juzi juzi na naongea juu ya juzi i think 2019 ikiisha 2019 ikiisha <laughs> 2019 ikiisha jamaa ako kamiti <laughs> ako kamiti Anapiga kifungo yake hata si bigi. I think anafaa apige miaka zake. <laughs> Atoke. Amepiga kamiti miaka tatu. Mbakisha one year yake safi aende mtaa. Wako pale kuna inmate ameingia right before jamaa aende kutoka. Jamaa ameletwa kutoka industrial area eh, remand prison nini anakuja kidogo kidogo wamekuwa tight washaanza kupiga story wanabonga yani ndio ujue timing inakuaga kitu kingine jamaa anamwambia lakini morio eh hey, mimi hata vile unaniona hii kamiti wacha tu nikae nitulie ndio vitu tumefanyisha mandume hapa nje si mchezo <laughs> jamaa bakala na muliza kwani umefanyia nini watu eh hey, aje nimekali kacheka likakuvuka walai hii utawala hii tumeijenga na free labor <laughs> Jamaa akakuwa curious Akamza what do you mean free labor Ai buda So sasa wasio akiteka ma free mnaibia watu masimu nini nini Eh si tulikuwa na call na maforman tunateka matatu watu wanapiga mjengo hapo usiku mzima jamaa kajishika kichwa wacha ufala buda before nikuta kamiti mzee wa sawa nilipeleka mjee usiku mzima ilikuwa ni nini oh ya 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 atiko yo conversation yote mpaka inafika point wanaanza kuambia na nilikuwa na shindwa nimekuona wapi we Yaani walikuwa yaani walikatua hapo wakachekelea na deadly wakaambia aki walai nimesikia crimes nyingi mimi mwenyewe ni criminal but sija wife anyua unyama kama hii So hapo ndio anapata hizi details zote so mkitupigisha malap huko nini maze tulikuwa gatu tunachukua matatu tunapigisha watu malap nini nini then inafika mahali lazima dere pia ala, alale so tukisimama ni dere anawekwa kando 
ndio sasa safari iendelee so mali unasikia mmesimama alafu tena imeanza ni dereva sasa ameingia kwa mix sababu dereva hata yeye hii tunamhitaji we need him ah akasema mazee ilikuwa a thing but squeeze ni kama hiyo kitu imekatika hajawajapiga hiyo nini tena but it was just it's amazing hizi ni story usikia la shindo what buda what <laughs> ah ai ah nairobi 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 ah wacha wacha ah tuachane na hayo <laughs> acha ni walete juzi juzi this is me going into story b mwaka ni 2019 covid haija come kitu ime come ni unemployment unemployment watu hawana kazi watu wako mbaya kitu inawekelewa kwa gazeti hivi notice oh job advert tunataka watu 15 wanaingia huko 3500 hakuna kazi Majamaa wakaekelea advert kwa gazeti. Kuna kazi wana advertise na sikumbuki ilikuwa ni kazi gani. Aki Nairobians nyinyi ni wanyama. Nyinyi? <laughs> sikumbuki ni kazi gani. Ikasemekana vizuri sana kwa hiyo advert. Wewe kuingia hapa, requirement ya kwanza ukishapita mchujo sababu kuna mchujo. Si najua mtakuja watu 3500. Tutawachuja tubaki na ile namba tunataka. Kwa hii namba tuko na requirements. Number one, lazima ukuje na zana za kazi. Beba simu yako, beba laptop. Na number two, lazima ukwe physically fit. So on the day, ile siku mnakuja tu hivi day one, tunataka tuwafanyie assessment. Tuone kama you have the gas. Tutaki watu wanazimia kwa kazi. No. You have the gas. The gas adwati liwekelewa kwa karatasi watu wakajaza wengi kwa hawa wase wengi wakawekwa nje wote ikabakishwa umati hapo ya karibu mtu 30 30 people wakaitwa hawakuitwa dandora hawakuitwa kariobangi madhare kibera no walai e westlands ya mababi hii wapi west west iko wapi iko huko e west wakaingia pale maze umati ya mtu 30 kuna wanaume mbao na wasichana 10. Ukaambiwa congratulations. Mkosa sawa. Mumekuja leo tulikuwa nataka mkuje leo sababu tuko katika harakati ya kuchange location. Tunaenda tu another building. Simnaona hata vitu tumetoa toa. Vitu zimebakishwa kwa hiyo building ni meza na kiti. Wakaambiwa all right. So kwa corridor kuna washrooms za male na females sasa beba vitu zako vizuri ingia pale kwa washrooms ziweke vipoa identify mahali umeziweka nataka utoe gwanda toa mlipata requirements mlisoma requirements imesema mkuje na nini kinyasa <laughs> na ladies wa bebe ngongos bas Aya. Mumefanya namna hiyo iko sawa. Very good. Kila kitu laptop pale. Eh eh nice. Now change into the Wanaume hapa kuna kitu. Ni hii kitu. Wakamaliza wakakuja kwa ofisi. Kila mtu wanakaa ni kama wako kwa recruitment ya jeshi. Wakaambiwa okay, tunataka tuanze na assessment ya physical kwanza. Then tutakuja kwa hizi other requirements baadaye. So let's all climb up to the rooftop. Tuingie pale kwa rooftop tafadhalini. Sasa hiyo ni kale kab- saa 12 na 45 eh. Kabaridi kengine kana kuoga hapo sikafiti. Nataka tufanye kitu inaitwa jogging on the spot. For 20 minutes. Sababu hii assessment tunataka tuifanye mwili ikiwa nini? Kiwa moto. Sasawa? Now this is what we are going to do. Eh, kila mtu anahesabu 15 seconds. Tumejipanga vizuri. We are 30 of us. 15 seconds. Ukianza, hesabu 15 seconds. Wewe next. Hesabu 15 seconds. Wewe next. Hivyo hivyo. Nataka tumalize kama ile kuna wimbo tulikuwa tunaimbaga tunaimbaga intense hivyo. Mnakumbuka hizo mawimbo tulikuwa tunaimba primary. 
a round song bass ro 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 your boat <laughs> Wewe nimekula ngori hii Nairobi. This is the opportunity. <laughs> Watu wakapiga pale jogging. 20 minutes zikaisha. Ah, 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 ah. My bad. Makosa ni yangu. After 20 minutes tutakuja kuambia. So nyie endeleeni. After 20 minutes someone will come. Yeah, na atawaita na hiyo order vile mmemaliza nayo. 20 minutes 25 that chia apana 46 muda ah wewe shuka nani shuka mazenda check ni nini bana majamaa wanashuka wanapata office to let <laughs> Meza na kiti Tukimbie washrooms wewe tuchukue vitu zetu oh! <laughs> Laptop Simu Nguo zao <laughs> What now Tulitoka jogging on the spot pale rooftop. Sasa tuna jog Parklands Road. <laughs> Tukielekea Parklands Police Station. Mara ya wala nguo. Watu hizi story na piki wangu naambia ase lies. Haiwezi wananitupia mpaka OB. Wezi kama mnani watch msiwai nifanya hivi. <laughs> Aki. Ju see imagine mimi ndio niko hapa na chanua wa kurugenzi alafu sasa nikuje hapa mimi ndio testimony. So believe it or not hizo vitu zilienda zote never to be recovered again. Paka leo wala zitafuta. Laptops nini kila kitu. Sasa cha kusikitisha mno ni waliingia Parklands wakaambiwa ah hata 3 months as Jaisha <laughs> Wamefanya hivyo tena au watu ni kina nani <laughs> Ah We tuibieni watu wako nazo haki mtu ana kazi una mekopa huko anunue laptop unamfanya mbaya Ah Pakurugenzi tukue ni careful maze <laughs> Stop your chanikati hapo Leo tambua sana tuonane next time. Alafu sana niambia jo mkurugenzi unatuchapia sana hizi stories za wase wanafanywa mbaya maze eh, investments zinakunywa maji. Hiyo ni fiti unatuchanua jo. Alafu si utuambia hata vile tunaweza kacheza. Ndio hata si tukiwa na investment zetu nini tu, vitu tunataka kuinvest. Maze to see to see big is blanda. Mnakumbuka story nilipiga thrice beaten still not shy. Hey lileta ngori unajua wase karibu wanisimu jo. <laughs> Shunzeme na waliniandikia mabarufu. Wewe madizi mayo kitu. Nataka kuongea na wakurugenzi. Basi hawa se after your story. Eh 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 eh. Barua tu. Cease and desist. <laughs> We want you to pull down that show. Apologize in front of you. Kama kuna kitu iliwagonga wanaisikia mpaka leo ni kitu inaitwa blue tick. Hata mwezi iliisha? Haikuisha? Simuliona? Kuna makosa tulifanya kweli? Bas, nawachanua sana bana, mnipatieni pesa nyinyi watu. Sasa